Hi Simmers, in this video I'm going over how to install the Realistic Zodiac Signs mod. I'll tell you guys in every video to make sure you read through the mod description simply because I do not want you to miss out on anything. Sometimes I go over videos at one period of time where this was the way to install it and then three months later they change something or they add something that you now need for this mod that is no longer there. So please understand that not all of what you need is always going to be covered in tutorials. So that's why I say read through the description. All right, now go ahead and scroll to the bottom after doing, you know, the description reading. And you should locate the link that you need to download, which is the Realistic Zodiac Personalities Mod zip file. All right, once you click it, it is immediately going to download. Go ahead and loc locate your file explorer at the bottom of the screen, but in the case that you don't have Microsoft, um, go ahead and just look for Finder for Mac users, okay? After you have done that, you wanna go ahead and locate your downloads folder. This is the same thing for Mac users, all right, guys? Once you find the file, Mac users, just double click your file. It's going to be a zip, so double click it and it will open it into a blue folder. In the case that you guys have some kind of extractor app or whatever's, um, you'll use that to open the file, all right? In the case that you don't have that, you are a Windows user, right click and then select extract. Guys, everybody's computer is different. Yours might say extract. Another computer might say extract all. It really just depends on your computer, okay? But the idea is to get the file open. After the file is open, you will see a folder pop up. Now, mine likes to show me what's inside. So this one is already automatically letting me know that this is too many folders deep what that means is that when the folder opens you see another folder which means it's too many folders deep which means that the folder inside of that folder needs to go into the mods folder i'm going to show you what i mean in a minute so we're going to exit that and we're going to put this in a comfortable position and then we're going to go to the bottom of the screen right click the file explorer icon after you do that, go over and find the documents folder, which is right here. After that, click the electronic arts folder, double click the Sims 4, and then locate that mods folder. After you've done so, go ahead and double click on that realistic Zodiac personality mod that is now open. When you do that, it will show you what's inside. And I want you to grab this folder that is inside the folder we just opened three seconds ago and drag that into the mods folder. When you double click, this is what you should see. If you do not see these packages, Okay, that means you did it wrong. So please like re rewind this video. <laughs> rewind this video because that means you did it wrong, sister. Okay. All right, after you guys have done that, you can feel free to do what I'm about to do right now and delete it. It's really entirely your choice. Um, it's not a have to kind of thing. It's just a thing I like to do to get it out the way. All right, please make sure you do your game option settings. Make sure that they are enabled. You need custom content and script for mods enabled. Please make sure you read through the description. So if there's any um, other mod or pack that is required for this mod, that you know what that is and you can get that downloaded. All right, guys, if you're still struggling, I have simplicitysim.com. You can check that website out in the description below. I have two eBooks on there that would be very helpful for you guys if you still need help. Thank you guys for watching. If this video is helpful, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you for watching. Like the video and sub to the channel if you haven't already. And I'm wishing you guys a wonderful rest of the day.